it's just been like, I've been sent some really good horror scripts. So I love the genre. And I think when it's done right, when it has like a really good story beneath it, um, I think it just is, they usually, they're films that I really enjoy watching. Well, hi guys, thank you. Thank you for taking the time. Uh, I love the movie I got to watch it yesterday. Uh, first question is for Georgina. I saw you last in Barbarian. Um, I actually went screen and did a screening of the film. I got to see it there. But uh, is there something that that draws you to these kinds of like horror, horror, you know, adjacent films? Yeah, I really love horror. I've always loved really horror. And I've, I've always loved horror movies. And I've always wanted to do a horror movie. Um, but nothing had come in um, that I liked or worked um, until Barbarian. Um, and then it's just been like, I've been sent some really good horror scripts. So I love the genre. And I think when it's done right, when it has like a really good story beneath it, um, I think it just is, they usually, they're films that I really enjoy watching. So, yeah. Diego, I, we spoke for two seconds, I think about, about Babylon once, which I remember that being like, one of your first big projects outside of Mexico. Uh, I know this was shot in Spain. Like, have you been trying very hard to work on more of these like big worldwide projects and and travel to other countries and do projects over there? I think it's one of the best parts of this job, like get to travel all around the world, but not like trying, trying, no, but uh, I would love to keep working in Spain, why not? Georgina, I know this is, I think the first time you've done a film in a, in a different language. Um, how much Spanish do you speak, if any, and what it was it like just being on set where maybe that's the, the language everyone is speaking? Um, I don't speak any Spanish. <laughs> I was very surprised when I got offered the job, um, but they were like, you know, you're an English character in it, you don't speak Spanish. Um, I have mm, a few few tiny lines where I speak a little bit of Spanish, but mostly I'm speaking English in the movie. Um, and being on the set, I mean, it was it was challenging. It was hard. It was different than what I'm used to doing. Um, but everyone was so lovely. And, you know, I had a translator and um, everyone was very welcoming and kind. So, yeah, it was good. I feel like you had that on, on Babylon too, kind of, Diego. But uh, you uh, in this film, you are in, you know, we meet you kind of in this group of, of interesting people. Um, both of you kind of like, Diego, what can you kind of say about the people that or your character and then kind of the group that your character is in when we find you? Well, I think he's like very smart and very like practical, but also he's always like, he obeys Rafa. It's like, uh, also every every character has like their hierarchy, hierarchy, how do you say that? Hierarchy, no? Right. And I think Octavio is in the lowest <laughs> in a way, totally. Yeah, Rafa is the leader. I'm very curious, you know, maybe you both can answer. Uh, when you're filming the outside scenes, walking through the streets and stuff, how thin are the blindfolds? Can you see? <laughs> kind of. A little bit. A little bit. Enough that you don't hurt yourself, I guess. But yeah. yeah. Okay. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, I think that's all I've got for you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Congratulations on the movie. It's, it's great.